Hello, you know, this is Esther, your coach on this eating healthy community, and we want to talk about water today. How much water should I take to lose weight? Hmm. A very serious question. Well, water has no calories. That is the first point you should note. Water has no calories. So if you take as much as you can, it doesn't add to your weight. It doesn't subtract from it. It is whatever you take that has calories that either that adds to your weight. So water has no calories. But water has some characteristics that works on calories. Number one, it is that water is a natural appetite suppressant. When you take water, it gives you a feeling of fullness that you don't have to eat more than necessary. Then water also increases metabolism. When your weight of metabolism is high, you tend to burn fat faster. So it increases the rate at which metabolic rate occurs in your body. Water also helps to remove waste from the body. Of course, you know through urine, through sweat, waste passes out of the body and water is essential for those processes. Water is necessary to burn fat. It's a no, it's, there is no two ways to it. You know, the first process in the burning of fat is lipolysis. And before lipolysis can happen, hydrolysis has to happen. Don't mind all those big, big grammars, but just know that water is necessary to burn fat. Also, during workouts, any workout you want to do, you feel tested. Before workout, during workout, after workout, water is essential. Now, how much of this water should I take to lose weight? That is a big question for today. There is no standard recommendation at all. Some require more, some require less. It depends on a variety of factors. It depends on one, your activity level, your two, two, your age, Three, your body size. Four, your temperature. Five, humidity. Six, how you expose yourself to sun. And seven, your health status. Based on all this activity level, age, body size, temperature, humidity, sun exposure, health status, the rate at which we need water to burn fat, the fat. What should you do? Take water as your body tolerates. Take water as much as you can. Take water as, as much as your body allows you to take water so that your metabolic rate is to increase it. Then there will be enough water for the policy so that fats can break down. There is no standard measurement for the amount of water to take. The amount of water I will take is different from yours. It's different from the third, fourth, fifth person. So take water as your body permits.